Well, from mutual funds to the stock markets and now investing in art. With the ever-increasing disposable income in India, art seems to be emerging not just as a philanthropic option, but a good investment too. Investing in art is catching on in a big way in India in recent years. Mumbai-based Tayyab Mehta's Demon King Mahishasura was the most expensive painting ever sold by an Indian artist. It fetched $1.58 million at a Christie's auction in London in 2002. Thus, art is now not just for art's sake. It spells big bucks too. Today, it's the size has put at 1,000 crores. But like, even we are planning of a fund of the size of 500 crores after this 150 crores. And we are finding where the people in the queue are wanting to take it. So if a little bit of educative effort is done, process is done, and the art is marketed properly, I mean, the size could be even 5,000 crore in the next two years. Auction houses and investment managers say art now accounts for 5% of personal investments, more than double the figure per percent three years ago. A growing number of Indians now see investing in art as a more prestigious and creative venture than trading in stocks. The people who are investing into you know, art, Earlier it was only the top-notch industries and all that. So one day today's market has changed. But today IT, doctors, corporates, everybody. But you have to give a presentation to those set of people. Right? It could be even a good shopkeeper also. The, the, the disposable income should be there, investable money should be there. It's how you, you present and how you bring in closer to the art. In India's fledgling art market, many investors rely on assessments by art management firms in deciding how much to pay. Art investment companies that have come up in India in a big way do promise a depreciation-free masterpiece and investment far safer than the stock markets. For India's fast-growing breed of high-value investors, this seems the way forward. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. Well, pictures such as this one over here are not just worth words, they're worth a few lakh rupees. So art is emerging as 